What's happening people? Welcome to the Surf and Stop TV and today we have got a treat for you. So my surprise for you guys today sits right under this high neck. So today we've got for you a Mexican black king snake. Uh, we've got down here our female Mexican black king snake. Her name is Calypso. Okay, so we've got Calypso in her heart at the moment. We're gonna leave her in there just for now because she is a little bit timid and she is one of our, uh, our Mexican black uh, breeding females. So uh, we don't wanna upset her too much. So let's talk about the Mexican black king snake. So as you've seen already, an absolute stunning species of king snake. Um, originate from, um, of course, the Mexican deserts, but also uh, you will find these species around the southwestern parts um, of of the USA, so um, Arizona, uh, New Mexico, that sort of area. Um, one thing you will find about these species as they have become incredibly rare, um, it is so hard to get your hands on one of these snakes right now. Um, a few years ago, way back when, um, these snakes were two a penny, and um, everyone had them, you could buy one of these snakes for around 40 pounds, um, everyone was breeding them, uh, and because there was no value, the breeders stopped breeding the Mexican black king snakes and um, eventually they sort of, not died out, but they, they just became a, a, an irrelevant snake and you actually couldn't buy it anymore. Uh, they are making a massive comeback because they are just absolutely beautiful um, and now everyone's trying to get their hands on them, but because um, there's not that many about, uh, the price on these things is actually shot right up. Uh, so they are making a comeback, um, breeders are coming back and uh, hopefully we'll have some more on the market soon. So if you're a beginner and you're looking um, into getting to your first snake and you've been asked me what snake species would you recommend, all day long I'd recommend a king snake. They are fantastic species of snake to home. Um, they are easy to look after, easy to maintain and they are terrific eaters. Um, and that's one good thing about having a snake is you want to make sure it is eating. You don't want to worry about always oh, my snake going to eat, it's not going to eat this week. One thing you can guarantee with a king snake is that they will eat, eat and eat. If you don't wash your hands thoroughly enough before handling one of these, they'll try and eat you too. Uh, but that's all just the joy of, uh, of owning, a, uh, owning a king snake. So I do fit these into the beginner category. Um, for people looking to get into snake, I would fit, fit the uh, Mexican black king snake into that category. Just bear in mind that if you've got uh, maybe younger children, these can be a little snappy. Uh, again, if they do pick a scent up, um, maybe from another raptor you have, or a cat you've got, um, they will pick up on that and they'll probably have a little chew. But it's not too bad. So with the MEK, one thing you are gonna get is a, um, a show horse. Um, this thing will dance um, in, your, in the vivarium. It is a very active snake. Although she's quite docile at the moment, Trust me, um, we hear her banging about all the time. She is um, a little terror um, in, the, in, the, in the tub we've got upstairs. Uh, so just make sure you provide a stimulating environment uh, for a Mexican king, because they do like to burrow. Uh, they do like to climb up high, so make sure you have got uh, sticks, bark, that sort of thing. Uh, and also give your snake um, a couple of hides, because like now, they do like their privacy. Just to see if she wants to join us. So I don't wanna Star fell, there's a lot of bright lights going on. Let's just see if she wants to join us. She is. She's absolutely beautiful. 
Put it down there, darling. I don't want to scare you. Don't do a runner. <laughs> right, so here she is. Um, here is Calypso in all her fantastic beauty. Um, she does like being handled occasionally, um, but uh, as she's just eaten yesterday, she ate um, one fuzzy and one rat pup uh, that one of our other snakes did finish yesterday. So uh, I sort of snuck in the, the, the tub for her there and she polished that off easy. Um, so let's talk about housing um, this species of snake. So you can use a wooden vivarium, um, a glass, you can use a tub like we use here at the Serpent Stop. And um, as long as you get that, uh, that temperature correct, which is for these snakes, we normally have um, about 31 to 29 in, the, uh, in that basking spot, in that hot area, um, and then about 25 degrees to about 28 in that cool end. So it's quite high. Again, these guys are from the Mexican desert. Um, so you're just gonna make sure that that, that heat is there. Um, as for humidity, um, just your basic uh, humidity in, in your room, so a moderate temp, uh, a moderate humidity level of about 40 to 60 percent um, is just like this species. Let's have another quick look at Calypso's colour. So she is a complete jet black from head to tail. She is stunning. Uh, this is perhaps um, one of the most, I'll really one of perhaps the most um, beautiful species um, of king snake you can get. And like I said, um, they're hard to get hold of now, uh, but they are making a comeback. Um, I know in the US they're becoming a bit more popular, and we're trying to find breeders over here in the UK at the moment. Um, ourselves, we are also uh, getting on the Mexican king snake bandwagon, uh, and we hope to produce some little babies um, in the not too distant future. So what's cool about this snake is when it does shed, um, because the entire snake is a jet black, you do see that darkish colour come off actually in the, um, in, in the shed skin itself, which is, is really cool. So overall, this snake is the perfect beginner snake. Um, they are so cool, they have such a nice temperament, they're incredible to look at. Um, as soon as uh, someone walks in your house, um, she is the first eyes that they have on. Um, absolute strange snake. Uh, feeding, you're not going to have a problem. Housing is as easy as, as easy as it comes in terms of um, owning a snake. And uh, yeah, she, uh, she brings us a lot of joy. And um, Mexican black king snake is perhaps one of the, the ways to go. And we hope to see more of these in the future. So thanks for joining me and Clips over here. Um, hope you've enjoyed her as much as I have. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for joining us guys.